a fashion show? I know Rafe can be a royal pain sometimes, but he's a good cop. Too good to get in trouble over a run-of-the-mill stakeout. I always suffer. but I... Honey, listen. Rafe's gonna be fine. Your show's gonna be a success. And I'll have Sammy playing poker like a real pro for you get back. <laughs> I'll bet you will. <laughs> Garrison, your taxi is here. Oh, thanks. Delilah, you sure you don't want me to give you a lift off the airport? It's starting to get real ugly out there. Oh, of course, thanks. But I do not want to be responsible for having you stuck in a snowdrift somewhere. No, thanks. Oh. Thanks. Mm. Good luck with your show, huh? I hope it goes well. <laughs> oh, Vicky. Thank you. Oh, thanks for everything. For a wonderful Thanksgiving. Oh, my dear. It was our pleasure. Don't you worry about a thing. We're going to take very good care of Sammy. Oh, thank you. Have a safe trip. Thanks, Clint. You have a good time in New York. <laughs> You've earned it. Thanks. Well, I guess this is it. Goodbye, everybody. Good luck. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Oh, thank you. I can't believe you're going to pass some pumpkin pie. What would your Mayflower ancestors say about that? You are starting to sound like somebody that we don't want to talk about. Katie, listen. I know I promise not to, but I do need to say a couple of things about your grandmother. Oh, Patrick, please, please. Please, just give me a couple of minutes, all right? I know that your head is still running around with all the charges and the counter charges. But I want to tell you that I told you the truth about what she did to me. And I told you the truth about the fact that I have forgiven her now. You are truly amazing. I, look, it wasn't easy for me, okay? But your grandmother's old now. And she's sick. And, well, I think that all her accusations against me just come out of her feelings of guilt now. No, it's her trying to deny her guilt. And if you're asking me to forgive and forget, I'm not ready. I don't know how you can be. Well, maybe I just have a different perspective than some people now. You see, uh, prison teaches you a lot about what's important in life. And it's, it's not the material things. It's, it's ideals. And it's dreams. And for your grandmother, that's the Sanders name and the Sanders family. Katie, you're all that she has left of that now. You're what she has to keep going. Please, don't turn your back on her. Not yet. At least give it a chance. Um, Miss Sanders, you have a phone call. Oh, uh, okay. Thanks. No, no more for me. I, I really have to get going. Why, 
Are you going to walk out on me now? Well, I, I said that I would uh, join the Buchanan's for dessert, and they're taking this family portrait, and they really want me to be there, so I really got to go. Katie, no, 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 no. I'm going to let you go. Not now. Sit down. Patrick, let go of oh, Katie, me. come on now. We just started to enjoy ourselves. Stay for a while, all right? I can't. I have an obligation to be with Cord and the Buchanan's. Well, what about your own family? We should go over and see how Elizabeth's doing. I don't care how angry she is at me right now. I have no intention of seeing Graham. How can you say something like that? She's your family. She's your flesh and blood. And that's a heck of a lot more important than playing family to the Buchanan's. Oh, I see what this whole nice act was all about. You're still trying to come between Cord and me. That is not true, yes, Katie. It is, and I am not going to be sucked into another one of your games. Now, I will say this one last time. I love Cord, and I'm going to marry him. And, and the Buchanan's mean as much to me, if not more, than my own family does. And I'm just grateful that they want me to be with them. Excuse me. What is it? We're stalled. But I'm already running late, and I'm going to miss my flight if we don't hurry. Ma'am, uh, I'll keep trying, but we could be stuck here for a while. How far is it to the terminal? It's about five blocks. Well, I'll just walk. Lady, you can't see a foot ahead of you with this snow out here. Besides, we're in the middle of nowhere. I'll manage. I have